Hi, today we'll see how to animate the wind force. I'll be using the 2.81 version of Blender. So first, let's delete the default cube, X to delete. Let's add a UV sphere, Shift A, UV sphere, and let's scale it, S5, Enter. Now let's add a subdivision surface modifier. So modifiers, add modifier, subdivision surface, and set the number of subdivisions to 3 in both render and viewport. Apply the modifier. Good. Now add a material. Materials, new, and set its base color to blue. Go to render shading. Fine. And now add a particle system. Here is the particle system tab. Add a new. Set its type to hair. Number to 5000. And check the hair dynamics box. Okay. Now go to front view and play the animation. You can watch the hair fall slowly down. Now as you can see the first time you play the animation is pretty slow, but the next time it's much faster. Okay. Now we want to add some wind. It should start blowing harder when the hair is already down, so around frame 50. First of all, let's add a force field wind. So Shift A, force field, wind. Now move the wind along the X axis G, X, and rotate it 90 degrees to the left. So R, Y, negative 90. Now go to frame 50. Then in the Physics tab, set Strength to 10 and insert a keyframe by pressing the right mouse button and selecting Insert Keyframe. And then set the following keyframes. Go to frame 100, set strength to 4, and insert keyframe. Go to frame 120, set strength to 15, and insert keyframe. Go to frame 140, Set strength to 1, insert keyframe. Go to frame 160, set strength to 20, and insert keyframe. Go to frame 170, set strength to 1, and insert keyframe. Go to frame 210, Set strength to 20 and insert keyframe. Now let's go back to frame 1 and let's play the animation. Now you will see how the wind force changes.
Again, the second time you play the animation, it all moves faster. Now, if you are satisfied with that, you can render the animation. And this is our final render. Okay, that's it for this video. If you like it, a thumbs up would be great. Also, make sure to subscribe for future videos. If you want to leave a comment or ask a question, you're welcome to do so. Thanks for watching.